hey y'all hey y'all welcome back to the channel today we have another thrift with me thursday woo woo. yeah we have had the craziest weather here we have been in a thunderstorm a tornado days and days and days and days and days and days of rain <laughs> so that is why we did not have a thrill with me thursday last week because it's been the craziest weather. But anywho, today we do have a little short thrift with me Thursday. And we are getting ready to go into the home goods. Now this home goods is probably going to be a really quick run. Because I need to run here real quick to uh, check out something that I want to see. I want to look at some uh, clear canisters, y'all. I want to change out my canisters. And I have this idea. You guys have probably already seen it done a thousand times. But I want to get these clear canisters and then I want to put some little teacups in them. So that's going to be a really, really quick little trip in here. Uh, I have been seeing on Na 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 Natasha's uh, channel uh, that she has been looking for Halloween in at home. So we are going to check and see if they have Halloween, which I doubt because y'all know Texas. We are the last ones to get any Halloween things. Okay. I'm not going to even look into Target until school has started back for a couple of weeks before i even look and target for some halloween stuff y'all but anyhow i don't even need any halloween y'all i'm going to repeat i do not need any halloween stuff okay anywho let's go ahead and hop into this at home and see what we can see I can already tell you there is no Halloween in here. We are still fully stocked for the 4th of July. And that is what I figured because here in Texas, they don't move that fast, y'all. They don't move that fast. <laughs> so I did a quick walk of the store where the Halloween stuff would be, y'all. And it's full of summer things, so I'm gonna just kinda um, look at what I came in here to get, and then I'm gonna get out of here because I have a really short lunch break. But, let me see. I don't know where I need to be, so let me see. Oh my gosh, y'all, they have so many rugs on clearance. My daughter needs to come in here and see if she can find one for Tiger's room. I mean, they have all sizes, different colors, different styles. All right, so I found what I need to see what I'm looking for, y'all. They changed this store around a lot because... Um, this stuff right here used to be on the outside aisle, and now they have changed it completely to the other side of the store. So, that is what I came in here to check out, y'all, to see what these sizes were looking like. Hey y'all, it is currently the next day. <laughs> I did not come back and end the video from uh, the at home yesterday. And I kept saying home goods, y'all, when I first started. So I was meaning at home, at home. But we are about to run into the home goods. I don't know how long I'm gonna be in here. It's probably going to be another quick little run because uh, we have a short lunch break again today. All right, y'all, sorry about that. I needed to uh, get some lunch uh, really quick. But uh, yeah, we're gonna run into this Home Goods really, really fast and get out of there. Y'all, I am in Home Goods and I think I have spotted the first Halloween something or someone that brought this back, but I have spotted Halloween in Home Goods. $29.99, y'all. So why I 
am in Home Goods. Uh, it's because I am looking for small little teacups. But I don't think. Oh, this is so cute right here, y'all. Oh my gosh. I don't think I'm going to be able to use teacups in my little clear jars because I ended up changing them out, y'all. But I'll let you guys know all of that when we get to that. <laughs> part of uh, me redoing those uh, counters. How cute is this little ladybug teapot? This is so cute. Y'all, these are so cute. I love the pattern on this one. And look at this one. It's so cute. These are like $1.99, $5.99. This one is hand painted and it's $3.99. Look how cute these are, y'all. Oh my gosh. I need to stop at Target. Uh, I was looking for a specific uh, clear jar at the at home. And um, I didn't like the way those jars looked. I thought they were going to be cute and different. But for whatever reason, I just... I didn't like them when I saw them in person. I loved them when I looked at them online, but seeing them in person, I was like, mm, no. <laughs> so I am going to end up going to Target and I'm going to get uh, the smaller little uh, clear jars because I have a larger one that I picked up from Target and, and you guys see that one in the hut, but it does not fit on the little shelf. Uh, you guys know why I keep my coffee and sugar and all that stuff. It doesn't fit on the little shelf. It's too big, so it kind of tilts back and forth. So uh, we are going to go with a smaller size of the canister, which I'm not happy about. I want the bigger size, but um, it, it is what it is. And I want to keep the little shelf that I have up there because... Uh, it has that little pull out drawer so I can put other little things in there, storage in there. Because you, you guys know I don't have that much cabinet space. Or, or yeah, is that cabinet space? Where's the counter space? <laughs> I don't have a lot of counter space. So I really want to keep the little cabinet up there for, you know, extra little storage and things like that. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and keep that little cabinet that I have up there. Anywho, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and share the thrifting session of this video because it is Thrift With Me Thursday. <laughs> I have completely forgot about that. So you guys go ahead and take a look. All right, y'all. So first up, we have this little pumpkin right here I thought was really cute. I wanted this to be like a Halloween Thrift With Me uh, like Natasha is doing. But y'all. It, we had nothing. <laughs> uh, as you will see, there are a few little pumpkins and things like that, but nothing really stood out to me as far as Halloween decor, y'all. So, you know, it is what it is at this point. <laughs> I did see a bunch of Christmas things, though. That little snowman was really, really cute. And then this was one of those... Um, Ah, uh, what do they call these? A box in a box. I'm just going to call it a box in a, a box. That is what it is. <laughs> and then I'm showing you guys the end cap. I saw these little wooden shelves, which I thought were adorable. And then, y'all, they had lots and lots of good baskets this time. I just couldn't believe all the good baskets that they had this time. <laughs> gosh y'all i am so sorry about tiger screaming but he was just getting so excited but i love that little basket right there i am going to regret not picking that up they had a bunch of those little wood um i guess you could call them jewelry boxes and that y'all that mug was so cute <laughs> i looked at this little basket but it was not any good y'all and then this chair i love the pattern that was on this chair I was so surprised when I saw this decanter in the store. I was shocked. 
Now, I'm going to regret not picking up these little containers. I just felt like I couldn't do anything with them because they were so small. But I'm pretty sure if I would have got them, I would have found something to do with them. And then, y'all, I'm not going to talk through this whole thing. I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of the video. And we will come back to see what made it home with me. Y'all, I love this eagle. And this is perfect for the holidays. But it was just glass. Now, if it would have been brass, I would have brought that home with me, okay? But because it was glass, I just was like, oh, I can't do it. <laughs> Y'all, this is it. This is what they have in here for Halloween, okay? <laughs> this is cute. And then they have this one pumpkin in the back back here, but that's $1.99. It's cute, though. But that's everything they have for Halloween in this store. All right, I did spot something. Do you, you guys see that in the background right there? That's a little ghosty. <laughs> so I spotted another little something something. How cute is this, y'all? y'all welcome to the haul portion of today's video i did pick up a few things this time and the first thing i want to share with you all is this decanter that i picked up now y'all i was so surprised <laughs> when i saw this in that goodwill because i don't know if you guys have seen uh down you're from golden finds video he did a couple of weeks ago when he redid his bathroom he put a decanter in the bathroom and he put mouthwash in it and I was like oh my god that is such a good idea so when I saw this decanter in the store I was like oh my gosh so I did pick this up y'all and this was $4.99 so I thought that was a really good price but I think that this is gorgeous and of course I am going to fill it up and put my mouthwash in here and also I was watching um Na, 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 Natasha sharing a video of Joanne's not uh, too long ago where there was a little um, a skeleton hand holding up the counter. You can easily find one of these if you find one of these and glue one of those Dollar Tree hands on this decanter and you have a uh, Halloween decoration y'all <laughs> and without paying that price uh, that Joanne has on that decanter. I don't remember what the price was, but I think it was a little pricey. But anyway, $4.99 for this, a dollar for the hand, stick it on there, and there you go. But yes, that is the first little find. Now, I have been mentioning in this video that I wanted to find some little teacups, or I don't know if I mentioned that I want to find some small little teacups to put in the little clear containers that I want to uh, redo in my kitchen but I ended up finding these little contain uh tea cups <laughs> y'all and uh these were in a pack of two and they were $3.99 and I found these at the Salvation Army and then they did have this one right here as well uh and this one was a single, but it was $3.99 as well. And y'all, did you see some of the prices that were in Home Goods? Some of the teacups that were larger than this were $3.99. They were handmade and they were brand new. So $3.99 for a used teacup and then $3.99 for a new teacup. Now this one right here, you guys, uh, has a P1 on the bottom of it. So I'm pretty sure it came from Pure One. 
but I just thought the color of this was really, really pretty. And I was looking for blue uh, teacups to put in the uh, containers. And then these are old. They have a little snap at the bottom, but these are uh, old uh, the teacups. So yeah, I thought these were cute. And with the season coming up, the holidays coming up, I felt like I could do, you know, blue and white and red <laughs> in the containers, but I do want to eventually, you know, change them up as well. Anywho, moving on, I picked up some books. You guys, they have started putting books back in the Goodwill because for whatever reason, they took them out and stopped buying them or purchasing them. Purchasing them. So when I saw these books, I picked them up and they are going to be perfect to add into Tiger's uh, little book nook when we get that all finished. But this one is a Walt Disney and that is Donald Duck by the house. Uh, these two are the Dr. Seuss books and you have the tooth book and then are you my mother now y'all i when tiger was really young i'm gonna say he had to be about six months or so maybe maybe older than that i, I had gone into the goodwill and they had a stack of books uh the disney books okay uh like this Dis disney books like this and they were, I forgot the price of those books. Uh, all of these books were $1.69. But I forgot the price of the books. And that's when they had books, uh, the tags, you know, the red tags, the yellow tags or whatever. They give you 50% off. So it was a stack of books. Y'all, they were all um, like Lion King. Um, what else? Uh, Toy Story. They were all related to boys okay they didn't have any Cinderella uh, any of that stuff in there and it was about 10 of the books I said I was gonna go back and get those books when they had because I think they had like a, either a red or a green but it wasn't that tag day it wasn't the 50 hour tag day and I was like I am going to go back and get those books. yeah when I went back in there to get those books they were gone I was so upset. I was so mad. But anywho, <laughs> uh, I managed to get these. I wasn't going to let these go. And then they had Diary of a Wimpy Kid. I don't know if you guys have been seeing on TikTok, if you guys even watch TikTok, but they have these little mini books that people are opening on TikTok. And one of the mini books is A Diary of a Wimpy Kid. So when I saw these in there, I couldn't believe it. I got two, but yeah, I'm going to be adding these to Tiger's collection. And the last two things that I picked up, y'all, was another one of these little baskets. I couldn't believe that this little basket was in the store. I said, oh my God, another one of these flat little baskets. And this one is smaller than the one I picked up the last time. So. I'm going to put that on the peg shelf. <laughs> and then I picked up this little guy right here. Uh, I need a place to put my dish towels when I am um, getting ready to wash them. I usually just throw them in there on the floor. But I have been wanting a small little round basket to put the towels in. And when I saw this one, I was like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. It's so different, so unique. And I love the color on here. So yeah, I picked this up and this was $3.99, you guys. But, and then the smaller one was $1.99. But yeah, friends, that is going to be my little haul for today's video. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Uh, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. It's free, y'all. It doesn't cost you anything. I would love to have you here. Now, you guys, as always, I hope you're having a great day, great week, whenever you're viewing today's video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. <laughs>